Pirates, we are here inside of my warehouse. Look at this thing. Look at that. Michael hard at work, Christopher hard at work, and we are about to go through an amazing unit. If you missed the previous video in this unit, we paid 1010 this backup bid, all this amazing military and more came out of just two boxes. We got just over five pounds of silver out of the second box that we opened up in this unit. There is a lot of stuff in here. I peek a little bit when I move a unit. Like there was a record player. I think the record player is a thousand dollar record player, guys. Like this is gonna be nuts. So we're gonna unload and start making a video and see what we got. I'm so excited to see in the art. The art I found out was very good too. There is so much potential. Herman Miller, $3,400 speakers we're about to show you. This is gonna be an incredible unbox. I can't even waste no time. I gotta get inside of one box here. I gotta just look at something. So I've been wanting to see in the art. I've been very intrigued of what could potentially be in these stores. Look at this. Holy smokes, Mike. Holy smokes. Look up Slovach. 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 Come on, baby. Okay. Oh, look at this. A watercolor. This could be good. It's got a great marking on it right there. Wow. And some stuff right here, too. That is a great watercolor on some type of papyrus. It's a bird and some flowers. I don't know if it's value, but I'm excited to see that. Right off the bat, first box out. This looks more artsy. More arty than not. I want to be careful. Oh, holy crap. Double sided. I don't even want to mess this up. That is cool. What if those are Ansel Adams? How will I? Oh, they're. I see. I see. Let me open them up here in a second. I don't want to leave this standing here. Holy smokes. This is somebody's keepsake box. Looks like there's an antique gold bracelet in there and some other stuff. Wow, I don't even know what to say about that. I don't even know what to say about that. That's the hardship for these stories that you, you all see us by. It's, it's the part that gets sad. Okay. What do we have here? They don't have any words on them. They're just photography. Maybe they're just photography. And they're not special. But I definitely want to see if they are some type of Ansel Adams. So we will definitely check into that. This box here is marked Barcelona. Second Barcelona trip. Like what do you guys do at uh the Olympics or something? Come on, that'd be great. World Olympic champion. Maybe they just packed all their stuff that they wore there. What? Holy. I see a cool little box. I see some nicely wrapped clothes. What do we got here? Vintage patina dye. That's a cool shirt. What the? What is this? This is a meditation bench. Oh, that's my first. That's a first for me. Come on, be some car hearts or something. It's got an interesting, this is called Hilt. I've never found this type of clothes, but it looks like a lot of clothes in here so far. Some cool shoes. Looking for some, ooh, here we go. Here we go, there's something tucked away in here. Oh, what are those? Little dice, little cubes? Like I said, oh, everything in this unit seems very interesting to me. It's a very interesting human, a very eccentric type. Here's a North Face jacket. What do we got there? 40, 50 bucks. Check the pockets. No. Be thorough. That is an REI jacket. Again, another 30, 40 bucks. This box right here, guys. So it's hard to not look in boxes. This one's marked masks and ancient vases. Like, are they really ancient vases? Like, come on. But, I don't know. That's the kind of box that makes you very, very intrigued, I think. I think it makes you very intrigued. And I, it was hard, oh. 
Okay. All right. Look at that. Those are kind of cool. That one's really unique. I like the work on that. The back. That is a freaking neat piece right there. What do we got here? Oh, Heart of Africa Primitive Art Collection. Zare Basagna will be used to leaf by the power it has incorporated. Okay, I think these have power and I'm all about them. Ooh. I don't know nothing about that guy. RBO. No, it's a Babe Ruth signed baseball. No. It's a really beautiful paperweight. And then we got what looks like a pouch. A pouch is a pouch, a pouch, a pouch, the famous Mr. Pouch. Somebody's artwork. That's a unique little thing. I kind of want to save that. That just seems neat. We'll put that aside. But the rest is real trivial artwork there. But look at this. Wow. That might just be the mother load right there. This will be interesting because there is a very nice record player. And I've been wanting to see what kind of records we got because you can have anything when it comes to records. Chick Corea. Hey, Jefferson Starship's all right, couple bucks. Classical, the Supremes, that's probably a decent one. Couple bucks, couple bucks. Where's the Blue Notes? Where's the Led Zeppelin? Where is it? This is the beginning. The Kinks, couple bucks there. Tchaikovsky, and the Ron Stamp. Double time. Jean Luc Pierre. Oh, Simon Grayson. Watch that big box that says painting on it. Can I have it? No. Come on, dude. It's supposed to be a Picasso. I hope it is, because I need some money. <laughs> Uh, we're like to like the strap there where you have the bed. Keep taking everything out, or what are we doing? Yeah, we got a long way to go. A long way to go. Got a long way to go. We're just started. <laughs> That's an okay record. I'm surprised because I was expecting good records for having the record player you're going to probably see here soon. All right, let's see what's in this other record box. Let's see what we got here the female prisoner, box. Donovan, Quicksilver. Silver Quicks? It is kind of cool. Yeah. Easy come, easy go. That's Jeff how it is. Take, take. We're just gonna flip through here and see if we can pull off something good. I'm not seeing a great record. It's weird because they got a really nice record player. Any million dollar record? Honestly, Michael, I'm not seeing any fire here. Is there even a million dollar record? Yeah, there is all first million dollar records. Eric Clapton, Lee Michaels. What's your guys' favorite record? If you uh, and also comment below if you can open any million dollar record. Let us know. Let us know the most expensive record that you could think of. There's got to be one. It's probably a Beatles pressing of a song that wasn't released. It's just like one ever made. Yeah, exactly. Signed by them. I've never seen that one, so that one actually seems like a good one to me. That's one of the times where I usually. Here's thirty bucks. Grand Funk. Closer to me. All right, that was kind of a dud in my eyes. Guys, this piece right here, I haven't got to yet, but that looks like it's several hundred bucks. Coming, coming at you. Sorry, that I wanted to go through that one. Lots of stuff, guys. I'm excited. Are you excited, Chris? He's not excited, guys. 
Looks like there's going to be a lot of basic stuff in here. Actually, there's another one of these, Christopher, a smaller one we could use for making. We're going to start making our own carne asada. Look at that. Gonna, if you're not going to use Those any are cook, nice. dude, then. Yeah, well, you're, I thought you were going to cook. If you go get the asada, I'll cook it. I like a good box marked paintings. You never know if it's a Picasso or if it's just. Yeah, that looks very interesting. Yeah, Kira. Oh, yeah, look at this. This came out of Michael's. This came out of Michael's video, and I thought it was freaking nice. Guys, I like this type of stuff because, A, I'm Native American, if you don't know, I'm like 12 or 15% Navajo, but I just like Native American stuff. Look at this piece right here. Wow. That, I've never seen one of those. That's like a freaking ax. Wow. This might be a little bit of money here, guys. This might be, I don't even know. This could be, Chris, you ever seen something like this? Look at this. It's a real Native American accent. I mean, you had to have seen something like that, dude. You're 15%. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're catching on. Chris is mocking me, guys. He doesn't think that I have. I, I mean, I'll believe it when I see the ancestry of me tree. I'm going to do it just so you guys can stop giving me grief. This is kind of cool. It looks a little trivial, more like artwork, but it's definitely a very cool watercolor. It says Carnaga. We gotta set that aside because we gotta no. Kenneth Parker Cinematography. What do we have here? Do we have some type of ink here? Let's see. We got no. No, that looks personal. These are different. Grand Canyon, Arizona. And we've got Kenneth Parker Cinematography. I don't know if that actually has value. I'm gonna have to look into that. That's a neat piece right there. I don't find photography too much. I'd love to find an Ansel Adams. Kenneth Parker. That's this person. But it is signed in number. I don't know. I don't even know nothing about this. I'll set this aside in my to go through time. Come on here. Let's, let's find something in here that's just. Okay. Now that is awesome right there, guys. I think that will end up in one of our auctions. Really well wrapped. Really well wrapped stuff. Look at this piece right here. Holy crap. Are they calling this an ancient vase? That is pretty old. I'm freaking. Oh, man. That's different. Holy smokes. Look at this one. This one's trippy hippie right there. Definitely going to put that through the uh, auction. Oh, wow. Santa Clara Nicosa. That is freaking exquisite, too. Wow. I'm blown away. I'm blown away. Oh, Michael, you, you, you decided to wake up. Look at this. That looks like Jesus. I could be wrong, but that is freaking awesome, too. And then we got a freaking Leonard, or Leonard Material Fraser jersey, guys. What is this? Ice hockey school. Okay. I thought that was uh, a real jersey. And then we have somebody's sports jersey. Very vintage. A hockey jersey. So that's kind of neat. I don't know why, but these boxes intrigue me the most. What is it about them? I like the way they're wrapped. It makes me wonder, like, what were you trying to protect? It's like, a, it's like saying, don't look in here, you know? What do you guys think? Let me give a big shout out to the cameraman behind the camera. Who is he? That's Dick Specs. Speaking of cameras, I'm intrigued about this. Come on, baby. I have not found a good Leica 
in a long time. That would make my world spin. This is a cool little bag. Okay. We got some knee braces. We got a back brace. We got extension cords. We could probably use those around here. Let's see, what do we have? Come on, Leica. Okay. We have this bad boy. That's a good eBay item, right? Probably. You want to put it on your eBay? Maybe. All right, we're going to put that in your pile over here. We have those things. Another one. I like that they're complete. This one's probably good money, too. You gonna want that for your eBay? And cops and stuff. Said there were slides in here. Here's another camera. Pretty cool one, don't you think? You don't sound very excited. <laughs> you don't sound very excited, Michael. This is supposed to be exciting. That's what I brought you in here for. I need that excitement, that, that sticks picks excitement. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, oh. oh my God, buttons. Those are some cool old buttons though. Uh, comment below if you guys like old buttons. We'll bring them to the old button show. This is a whole box of buttons. What's down here? Is this the $100,000 item? Nope, but they're nice shears. We could sell this all as a lot. Vintage buttons are pretty hot and collectible. There's a lot of people doing a lot of things with vintage buttons. A lot of things. A lot things. of things, Michael. Another camera. Is it in here? Yes, it is. Wow. It's freaking in there. You know what's weird? These were all so well labeled. I thought this was going to be the money. I thought this was going to be the money. Like, they got me. Look at this. Is there Bitcoin on this? Wow. That worked, Michael? You want to dibs it? That's nice money right there. Nice money, all right. Let's see what we got. Oh, wait a minute. Dun, dun, dun. What is it? No, it's, uh, it's actually pretty good, guys. Yeah, it it's called a Caldor. I, I, I knew I had a feeling that I could see these before. What's the number on them? Can anybody, can you guys read Roman numeral? Let me come over here and give you a little look. It's definitely a Calder. It has a little signature here on the bottom. I don't see any nothing on the numerals. Let me get that other style. That's pretty. I got Probably. the pink. Caldor. And it says XIX-L. So I'm thinking of a thousand maybe. I don't know. This is a very pricey artist though. I think it goes, yeah, probably not go. This is kind of weird. What do we have here? I just like the way this one looks. Okay, let's get this here. Do the same thing that way. Be very careful with my frame. Okay, peel that over. Dang. I see Picasso. I know. It had me excited there. This what? had me really excited. Oh, so it ain't knocks on It's a litho of 500. Oh, okay. I don't know what that's worth, but that is freaking, I mean, my, my chills. One Picasso. Because when, 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 when I looked at it, all I saw was this part. I didn't see the... I thought maybe that might have been Pablo or something, but... Guys, look at this one right here. Buddha Moments by Jack or something De Lauren. De, I don't know. This stuff is very intriguing to me, though. we got three more art boxes here. I definitely want to get through those. I want to see what they are. That silk piece right there. That I think this is money. I've never seen something like that. It's taking up a whole lot of space. Oh, 
Look at that. Why do I feel like this has, has some potential? That is something. What's the back say? Anything? Right here. Eclipse. 200 out of 3. Eclipse. Come see his signature, Christopher. Maybe you can make it out. I mean, I, I'm good. You're good at reading cursive from all those military letters. You know what? I, I, don't, I don't have the skills for that. I feel like this is almost something right here. It has that look. Doesn't this have a look of something you're it, like... It does have like a fancy... Or like, it looks like a bouquet of flowers. And yikes. Um, we're going to come back to this in a minute. I don't know. help him pull this end out. This is interesting. It's like a man. I mean, he's like a woman. He's like love. Hold the bottom, Michael. He looks at that. It says something on the back. Sadie and the Song and Dance Man 2007 wishing best Doug Arena Rosenfield. Right, a reason Ronan fell? Best wishes. No, no. Best, best, best wishes, Doug and Diana. Wow. It's, they're like tangling or something, you know what I mean? Like, no? You like this? I mean, I yeah, like it. That's cool. Yeah. Pirates, I'm freaking blown away. This right here, I told you I wanted to go through this again. Um, I just looked this up. Serena Rosenfeld. Michael, move that box off of there. That's a good piece of art right there. And I like this one better than some of the ones I've seen of hers. It just says romance. This piece here is freaking incredible. Old silk right here. I don't even know where to value that. This piece is here has got me astonished because I can't figure out nothing on the name. And then we have this and the cow door. Guys, tell me that this has not been a jackpot storage and we still have all those other boxes to go through and all this great stuff. I mean, I don't even, I'm speechless. Like, imagine we just found those antique jars. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and... Ah!